When the world came to be, millions of years ago, there was nature. As man had evolved through time, he progressed hand in hand with the natural elements and learned how to live in harmony. In today's era, however, nature seems to have taken a backbench. This is dangerous precedence given how without nature and greenery, mankind cannot survive. This crucial aspect of Mother Earth must be preserved with individual efforts now. You don't have to be a hippie or nature lover to recognize the importance of landscaping, garden spaces, and natural resources. They help purify the much polluted air we breathe to provide sustainable oxygen. In order to maintain the natural cycles of sustenance, we can use small garden ideas or larger backyards with very low maintenance. Today, we will discuss home garden design ideas to replenish the forlorn spaces in your beautiful home. With a little creative thinking, you can have a beautiful garden in the backyard, patio, balcony, window boxes, or even your living room. Number one, evaluate the environment before you choose suitable plants and trees. Whether you want to build a beautiful garden in your front yard or backyard, you need to analyze how much space you have available for the task. If you have a large open space, then you can consider larger fruit trees such as mangoes, oranges, plums, apples, pears, and whatnot. You can also plant shrubbery for blueberries, strawberries, blackberries, and others. You can also choose tall fig trees and cypress for the front yard for some shade. If, however, you have limited space around the pergolas and your house, then consider smaller plants and trees. Roses and other flowering plants add a splash of color to your garden plans. You can create a flower garden on a raised garden bed for added effect. Number two, create a garden patch for vegetables and herbs. A home garden is a veritable cornucopia of opportunities to pot and plant your own veggies. You can create hybrids or simply choose the traditional route. Either way, your family will always have an ample supply of freshly grown garden vegetables with no added preservatives. Whether you have a cottage garden or a mid-century home with a beautiful open space, vegetable gardening is quite satisfactory. You can grow tomato plants, potatoes, radishes, onions, beans, carrots, and whatnot. Vegetable plants are relatively easy to grow. You can create a small section in your garden to grow fresh vegetables. You can also use low-maintenance terracotta pots to allow the plants to grow in the initial stages before you transfer them into the soil. A herb garden is just as easy to grow and maintain. You can plant chilies, oregano, sage, and other varieties of herbs in the convenience of your garden space. If the herbs are flowering plants, then make sure they have access to pollinators for healthy growth. You can easily build a herb garden using hanging baskets or container gardening as well. Since these plants take up limited space, they can be instilled inside the house or in a kitchen garden as well. If you are worried about pest control, pollination, and improving the rate of productivity of your herb and vegetable garden, consider companion planting techniques. If you can revitalize the garden space for maximum utility, then this form of gardening technique can yield great results. Number three, get creative with DIY potted plants. DIY is all the rage right now and gardening ideas are no exceptions. When designing your beautiful, not to mention useful home garden, consider DIY potting techniques to add some flair and personal touch to your garden space. As you probably know, container gardening is nothing but using a medium, such as terracotta pots, baskets, flower beds, and others for your planting need. But you can build these containers from discarded wooden pallets, broken ceramics, cement, and other low-maintenance materials. Container gardens are also cost-effective, and if one breaks or falls apart, you have the materials handy year-round to resuscitate the plants. Number four, effectively use the area around garden sheds, pergolas, and trellises. 
If you happen to have recreational structures and fencing around your garden, then don't shy away from utilizing the garden space around them. For instance, if there is a pergola or garden shed, or even a gazebo in your backyard, then consider encouraging some climbers along the lengths of the wooden frames, beams, and ceiling. The splash of greenery against the dull colors of wood and paint can add some much-needed flair to the area. This system also works well with trellis and wooden decks. The climbers grow around the structures adding color and vigor. If these creepers and climbers happen to flower or yield pumpkins and whatnot, then they increase the aesthetic value of the structure by leaps and bounds. You can also use the garden space around these garden structures to grow flowers, veggies, and berries that require shade from the scorching sun. Although a source of nourishment, the heat can often wither the stems. Therefore, shade is welcome for these plants. Number five, add an extraordinary aesthetic element. A large garden provides an opportunity to explore dramatic garden accessories and water features. All you need is a little creative thinking and understanding of what will best suit your outdoor space. A cascading outdoor waterfall, an ornate fountain, a small duck pond, a bird feeder or bird bath, a birdhouse, a gazebo, or a beautiful seating area are all good choices to improve the aesthetic value of your outdoor space. You can choose one or more items from the range of selections and place them in optimum positions to create a focal point. You can also install a garden swing or hammock to relax in your home garden on a lazy Sunday afternoon because, well, why not? Well, that's it for today's video, guys. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Also, you can turn on the notification bell to get more latest videos. See you in the next interesting topic.